Um, I may not have the gamepad set up. Hold on. I'm going to try to use the Xbox gamepad rather than PS1 controller, which I could easily plug in, but... Did it recognize it? Yeah, all right. It recognized it. Cool. There's only like three buttons in this game anyway. Subtitles are on. Captions are on. Cursor speed. Make it slow. Well, the cursor is the pointer, I think, so we don't want to do that. Yeah, this is a very iconic intro theme, right? Been humming it for the past couple of days. One handed control? No, just use default controls. I don't know if it's cute. If you like anime, it's a great game. Um, there, are, it's it's mainly story. There's a lot of reading that I'm gonna have to do. There are some fight scenes. They are what they are. Let's see how we do with them. It's mainly like just point and shoot. That's the way it is. But. It can get dark at kind of times. There's a lot of themes in it where it does get dark. I mean, it wouldn't be dark if it wouldn't be a Hideo Kojima game without it being dark, so. How do I get out of this? Default. Controls. Subtitles. Go back. Go back. Stuck in a loop. There we go. Alright. So we're not using the gamepad. We're using. And we're not using the D-pad, I have, for some reason, set up to use the analog stick. That's fine. I'm lazy. I'm not going to put the PS2 controller in. I could. Probably should. I'll do it for the next stream. i to play it with the official controller. Ready? Nope, oh, wrong button. There we go. Which memory card do you want to use? Memory card one? Hopefully it's set up right. Thank you for your patience. And now, our feature presentation. A little loud, isn't it? Enjoy the show! Your popcorn ready. The year was 2010. Mankind has completed its first space colony beyond coast. The colony outgrew our cradle. The group of police officers trained as astronauts was charged with providing security. Those expected to immigrate to the colony in 2013. Kind of like a Beyond Earth scenario. From Scotland Yard, Gates Becker. 13 years ago, right? Of course, the Italian guys from New York. Ed Brown. I'm not going to read. These subtitles, they go too fast. I think on the cutscenes, you guys could read them. I'll read everything else. Give me a little bit of a break. See how that goes. The game is also very loud. I gotta lower it. This is our lead character, Jonathan. This is how... what happens to him.
that's your opening story. I'll explain it in a second. 25 years later. Had yeah, good times. 13 years ago, we had our first colony. Space station, I guess, right? So here's what happens. They took five police officers, put them in outer space to train them to be the police of the colonies. He goes out for a spacewalk, something bad happens, he gets thrown out into space, and he goes hurling into space. There you go. What? I can't change the sound? Here. Oh. AKA her. Putting credits. Yeah, Mr. Kojima. I'm actually, this is exciting to me. I might go and play Metal Gear Solid at some point. Never played Twin Snakes version. How's the sound? I hope that's not too loud. You guys can hear me? Uh, maybe more like two hours. A lot of anime. We hear you hear me. Okay, perfect. Put it right there. I don't know why this emulator doesn't let you change the sound when it gets running. Hold on, maybe if I go through the PlayStation. Yep. Nope. The emulator's sound output can only be changed when it's not running again. Just watch this beautiful animated intro. So he ends up in outer space, hurling through space for 25 years, a lead character. And then they somehow rescue him and bring him back to Earth. Thing is, he still looks the same. Like, he was cryogenically preser preserved in outer space. But he never aged because of that. How he lived, I don't know. He had no food, no nothing. Somehow he survived. But everybody else got older because it's 25 years later and they were back on Earth or in the colony.俺は。もっとも鉛筆事故で宇宙をさまよっていた俺には、わずか数年前のことにしか思えない。まだ生々しい記憶だ。妻や友人、仕事。何もかも30年前に置いてきてしまった。あの事故で過去を失った俺は、
Lorraine. My wife. My wife? Yeah. No, that was a long time ago. We moved to beyond and remarried after my accident. She's someone else's wife now. He's a Nisai, half Japanese and American. There was something kind of mysterious about her. I was a cop, fresh out of the academy. Look at us, young and in love. A lot of different things to say. Go back. This is his wedding photo. Take a look. This is me and Lorraine at our wedding day. I was still a cop here in LA. Lorraine dropped out of UCLA and after we got engaged. August 24th, 2009. So you could click on different parts of the photo and get different info, I guess. One day I'll never forget. Lorraine was like an angel in her wedding dress. I remember discovering the rental tux didn't fit right for the, cer for the ceremony. I originally had a black tuxedo. About the flowers. Does he have any comments about the flowers? Lorraine had this friend at a flower shop or ranger bouquet. A lot of details here. A lot of details. How about the cigarette butts? This is an ashtray I stumbled across at an antique store. It wasn't easy finding one of those. You don't need an ashtray for bent cigarettes after all. Bent cigarettes are cigarettes that don't produce any secondary smoke, which is which you simply light simply by breaking off the end. What? So he's either smoking the filter or smoking without a filter. How does that help? I say light, but there's no actual fire involved. They work off a chemical reaction, and even the leaves are specially processed. They don't give off any smoke or ash, and they make a room more pleasant. They're not my thing. The butts are starting to overflow. I guess I should empty them. Well, you got a gun here. What do you got to say about the gun? This is my baby, a Beretta 92F. I used to be, I used one since I was a cop. So, 29 years later, I think this is 20, 40 something, right? Let me double check that. That's a good question. And the Star's handgun, yeah, pretty much. Here does police knots take place? It takes place... So, he gets lost in space in 2013. This is 25 years later, so it's 2038. Close to 2040. 2038. Looks like that star's handgun and badge, right? It's a bona fide recoil gun, equipped with a laser sight. I use special 10 round magazines with armor piercing bullets. I don't carry her, but I can go around shooting everything in sight. She's strictly for protection. The game looks good on stream. This is pretty pixelated. Let's see if I can fix the resolution in the next stream a little. Actually, maybe we could do it now. I think it'll let me. It filter. Yeah. I don't think it's gonna filter anything. Unless we actually restart the game. Our gent, how are you? Bill Sportman Kojima. So I put those emotes in better from Better TTV. I even put a Natalie Portman emote because I love that song that um, that rap she did that Braxton Wise posted on the Discord. I figured, let's go with Natalie Portman. And... For some reason, they wouldn't show up on Twitch. Like, I did everything I was supposed to do, they just wouldn't show up. So, I don't know what's going on there. I gotta look into that. 
Thanks for sharing that Kojima one. I put two Kojima emotes in. Fuck. It's a beer can. It's empty. I used to use aluminum for cans before, but these ones are made from biodegradable plastic. I see them. Oh, you see them. It takes time to show up. Okay, so when I I put them in right before I started streaming, like right when I turned on Twitch, so maybe that's why it didn't show up yet. But if you see them now, we could use them. You added them in your in chat, Arrogant, and I didn't see them. So maybe they're slow for me. Okay. Maybe next stream they'll show up. <laughs> Sorry. pretty cool <clears throat> these are Muslims the only cigarettes in the world that still give off secondary smoke I don't like pure bent cigarettes you get today I call them bent cigarettes I don't know what that actually signifies the only brand I touch now is Muslims what else you got here message this is a piece of paper with information on a client I've been asked to look to, for their four-year-old son. You just don't see many ransom kidnappings nowadays. It's safer for the kidnappers to quickly sell off the victim's organs to organ buyers. Oh, bad. They guarantee to see a return that way, too. I get a bad feeling about this one. That's where I used them from earlier as well. Okay. Remember to smoke heavily. Kids, enjoy your video game. Yeah, I'm going to look into that, because it didn't give me the option to actually look at any better TTV emotes when I was live on Twitch, or on chat, so maybe next stream they'll show up, on my end at least. This is a video phone with a built-in printer. Why would you need a video phone with a built-in printer? So I've disabled the video from my end. Most of my cases come in over the phone. Clients don't particularly like meeting up in person. Play messages. All right. I should check the machine. Maybe there's a call from someone with a case. Sorry. Wrong number. Thank you for wasting my time. Still no offers. Any other messages? Let's see what the next one says. Hello, Mr. Ingram. This is the Department of Water and Power. This is your final notice regarding your water bill. <laughs> Maybe if you gave me something I could actually drink. When's someone gonna call me with an actual case? Imagine calling the wrong number and leaving the message after it beeps. Why not just hang up? I agree with you. Why leave a message? Oh, sorry, wrong number. Hang up. Let's see what the next one says. John, where you been? I feel like crap too. You know, that's why I'm a star. Yeah, yeah. Maybe next time. Still no offers. Oh, that kind of sounded like an offer to me. See what the next one says. You piece of shit detective, remember me, you little punk? I got news for you. This ain't over. Watch your back. That wasn't very nice. When someone's gonna call with an actual case. Any other messages? The Japanese language is so cool. Yes, it is. I wish I knew Japanese. I know a couple of words here and there, but that's pretty much what everybody else knows. It. Most. Hi, Tim Olson. We talked before. Listen, I'm not going to be needing your services after all. Thanks anyway. There goes another. And someone gonna call with an actual case. Idami no hito ne. You know Japanese, Arjun? I did not know that. I don't know what you just said, but sounds good. Let's see what the next one says. This is the whole game. You just keep checking your uh, answer machine. 
Cyborg. The Cyborg. It's got an extra pair of legs. God damn it. That's why some people shouldn't have kids. Still no walkers. I studied it, but I don't know anything. At least you studied it. Sounds like you know some words. That's the answering machine. Let's have a look here. This is a miniature beyond? A oh, beyond. Oh, beyond is the, uh... They call the space station. Ed made it for me. Ed's in a couple of pictures on the wall. Ed Browns is one of his best friends. This is a newspaper article from when I was rescued from the Emps survival ball three years ago. I spent 25 years inside this thing waiting to be found. I had cosmophobia ever since. I c just can't go out there anymore. This is a picture of me taken when I was a police on it. This was a relatively small article in a corner of the newspaper. Even give them like a hero's welcome kind of article. Ichi Nissan Shi. One, two, three, four. Yeah, Ichi's one, I know that. Ichi ni san si. So that's one, two, three, four. Beyond hiragana and romanji pronunciation of Japanese, I'm at a complete loss for translation. Well, you gotta start, you know, the numbers, a couple of words. It's tough, when you don't practice it every day, like, I don't practice my Italian as much anymore. You kind of lose it. I don't have the confidence anymore to speak Italian. I got to pick it up again. My wife's learning it, so hopefully when she learns it, we could speak it more. It's... She. Okay. Also, death in black. She, death for black. I know she means death because of the comic book. For death for black. Gotcha. Base Station of the Beyond. This is a newspaper article written at the time of the Beyond's coast completion. It was written 28 years before the article about my rescue. For sure, I was into Japanese more when I was watching lots of anime and Japanese films. Same year. Like, ever since I was a kid, I just wanted to, like, experience Japanese toys, Japanese anime. It was so cool. Here's the picture of Beyond Coast. After it was completed, the only thing that had finished was agricultural was the agricultural ring. The model Ed made for me is supposed to be the colony. Early photo. It does need a remaster. It came out on the PS3. I don't know if that was remastered. I doubt it. And that was still not released in America for whatever. This is a newspaper article about my accident that occurred during M spacewalk outside beyond. It was written three years ago, uh, three years after the one about the beyond completion. This is a picture when dur taken during the test spacewalk of the Yuri Model M's. It was a prototype police suit for use outside the colony, the successor to NASA's MMU. No problem. Have a good night, Mitral. I'm glad you were here to see the ending of Crusader No Remorse. That was such a cool game. I will see you uh, next time. I'll be online hopefully tomorrow. Work won't be crazy. I'll be working from home, so I'll stop in on your stream. Stop in on a lot of streams. Yeah, Crusader No Remorse was a great game, so definitely going to play No Regret at some point. Definitely. Have a good night, Mitral. Him. I guess we don't really need to read everything. It's more about the story. Let's read about his badge, and then we'll, we'll take a walk outside. I think that's what we're supposed to do. This is a replica of the badge I had in LAPD. The finale was not a remorse. The finale wasn't really a battle. I was a little surprised. I thought someone said last night, oh, it's going to be a tough battle. I think they were being sarcastic. 
This is a replica of the badge I had in LAPD. Sure does take me back. There's a picture from those days on the wall. Oh, we missed that picture? Picture? Yep. This photo was taken to commemorate the selection of the police knots. Five officers out of all this, all the world's police organizations were chosen and trained. We're called the original cops after the Mercury program's original seven. We're wearing ejection escape suits here. These are obsolete now. How does this look? On Twitch. Not that it matters, but... There is. Yeah. Not that bad, I guess. For a PS1 game. Back then, everyone thought the orange-colored suits were cool. Orange is my favorite color. That's why I'm wearing an orange shirt today, but... For space shoot? I don't know. This is a picture from when I was in LAPD. Me and my partner Ed were always together. They're kind of like best friends. It's great in 480p. Edo Brown. I'm enjoying it. Ed Brown. The one guy I trusted with my life. My best friend. And a good partner. That badge on my desk is a replica of the one I had then. You could see very... You know, Mel Gibson, Danny Glover. Glover-ish here. Taken in 2010. Me and Lorraine were a happy husband and wife. That has to do with the picture, but... Alright. Uh, this is an investigation report to a client. Though I haven't gotten very far with it. It was another child kidnapping, but my negotiations with the kidnappers failed. I couldn't save the child. That's terrible. He's probably already been cut apart and his organ trafficked to the buyers. Oh man, sorry kid. He failed miserably. Go outside. I don't have anything to do outside. It's still very early anyway. I'll wait here for that client to show. So is there something that triggers the client to show up? What system? Oh, this is to save the game. We should save it. I'll do a quick save too, just in case. Yeah, there you go. Safe state. Back up. There are some Venetian blinds I found at antique stores. Don't like the adjustable glass you get today. I put them up so you can see inside the office from outside. This guy's very opinionated, and he has a lot to say about stuff. Alright, we need to trigger some, like, new scene here. These cabinets are filled with information on past cases and clients. They're not exactly a pleasant read, but the papers inside are worth their weight in gold. Hang on. Play this in retro. Most of the Police Not fans are, who play these games, or this game in particular, are from Japan, so they're probably not even awake right now. Or if they are, they're just waking up. No. Can't go outside. Because we need to see everything. Given this award by the mayor back when I was a cop, me and Ed were a well-known team in the LAPD. This is a newspaper article reporting on the success of the first manned mission to Mars. I took part in it while undergoing my police knots training. It was written the year before the article about the EMP, ES accident, the EMPS accident. This is a picture of the me encountering a Mars rover on the surface. 
It was sent to Mars with the Mars 96 mission. This was before the Mars rovers. They kind of predicted that, didn't they? Oh, knock on the door. Oh, well, who's this? The client actually showing up on time. It's open. Hello, Jonathan. Trying to do a little voice acting. Lorraine! It's his wife. She remarried. Surprised? It's been, what, 28 years? What are you doing here? Look at you, you haven't changed a bit. Should I read over the cutscenes? I could probably pass for your mother now. That's right, she aged, he didn't. Lorraine. Why is she here now? It's all very common words. Yeah, they go straight forward. No slang. I didn't. Ex I don't expect you to forgive me. I know I've got a lot of nerve coming here. But you're the only one who can help me. What's wrong? Something's happened to my husband. Uh -oh. Time for us to slip in, right? Take her back. I see. All right. Well, come on in. Yeah. To be honest, I'd rather not. If you wouldn't recognize me, I just won't, wouldn't feel comfortable. Fair enough, Lorraine. Or should it be, ma'am? At any rate, you'll need to fill me in. Talk to Lorraine. Wearing white gloves. Jonathan, don't look at me like that. I'm 55 now. Old. She's embarrassed. Is that an Ellis? They cost a fortune here. Yeah, but this one's a little old. All the rage on home, too. Ellis changes the design of its bag every year while producing the limited while producing them in limited numbers, then destroys all the originals. That's why they're so expensive, is it? What else can we ask her? Or about her necklace? And that necklace couldn't have been cheap. Yeah, it's Pearl. Thought it was easy getting hold of pearls on Beyond. It wasn't easy. That's right. They haven't had any success with culturing mere pearls there. The number produced? on home continues to drop every year. All right, I think we need to talk to her. We're just making small talk at this point. It's awkward. Hey, Lorraine. Yeah? Uh, this is how we do, ask her about things. Like, why the heck are you here? Ask about her requests. Why don't we get to it then? De so something's happened to your husband. Exactly three weeks ago, my husband, Enzo Hojo, left for work and simply never came home. I've been to his company and the police, but no one ever, will, no one will help me. And now you're trying home? I have a real bad feeling about the whole thing. Maybe he went into hiding. Oh, come on. People don't just disappear in a space colony. It's impossible to stay hidden there. Had he received any threats? Not that I know of. It's as if he just vanished into thin air. Doesn't fit the profile of a ransom kidnapping. <laughs> Excuse me, all this reading. We need to drink a lot of water and stay hydrated. So her husband got kidnapped. That's what she's here. You have kids, Lorraine. You have any kids, Lorraine? He doesn't even know if his ex-wife has kids. All he knows is she remarried. 
I have a daughter. Her name's Karen. Daughter. Where does your daughter live? Karen is a news anchor on Beyond. A news anchor, huh? Pretty famous there. What's Beyond like these days? Beyond's different. A lot different. You wouldn't recognize it either. Everything settled down there. It's pretty much like an ordinary city now. Now let's ask about her husband. Oh, this Hojo guy, what's he like? Well, Kenzo is also in the same. He works as a pharmaceutical engineer for Takagawa Pharmaceuticals. He's honest and hardworking. He's never hurt anyone. I brought a picture of him. That's him there. A lot older. Looks like a nice guy, enough guy. And you look happy. Yeah, I am. Was anyway. Well, you hang on to that, yeah? A little early for that, isn't it? Her marriage to Hojo. This is starting to get a little too personal, considering we were married to her, and this is the first time we've seen her in 28 years, and it's kind of like, hey, whatever, but what can I do to help you? And up with your ex-husband and your daughter. How'd you guys meet? I moved to Beyond right after you went missing? After how much you hated it? I just wanted to be closer to you any way I could. I met Kenzo at the Nihoj Nihon Jin Matsuri run by Tokugawa. Nihon Jin Matsuri? It's a festival for Japanese people on Beyond. But why were you there? I have Japanese blood too, remember? Gawa. Let's ask her about Tokugawa. The conglomerate's reach doesn't stop at beyond. They essentially run space, and Joseph Sadoki Tokugawa runs the group. Just as well known on home as he is out there. If Hojo is a Tokugawa employee, I suppose we can totally rule out he was kidnapped. A dream of fantasy, yeah. He wanted to live in outer space and rule outer space, probably. You can get good money out of that, I'd imagine. Ask her about Tokugawa, she's That happened 400 years ago. No one on Beyond even thinks of messing with Tokugawa. They're too afraid of the retaliation. Be worth it. Like messing with Elon Musk, right? Put out the comedy. Talk about... Let's tell her about ourselves. You might want to listen to that. May or may not. Alright, well... Why don't I tell you about what's been going on with me? I've been working as a private investigator the past few years. Have you been... Have you probably guessed? Finding work can be a bit of a struggle, but I'm managing. I see. That's good to hear. She doesn't really care. What we have to say, right? Let's talk about old LA. Not a whole lot's changed since me and you lived here. Now LA is a separate place, just up north. We get the odd bit of snow like today as well. Some real crazy weather. Snow in LA? Metro shut down once the ghettos completely took over. Big difference from Beyond's growth. Times have changed, and this place got left behind. Talk about work. This is basically me reading a visual novel. For the most part, there's a couple of fighting scenes, uh, shooting scenes mostly, but we're here to solve what happened to her husband. On home, kidnappings are becoming most, almost as frequent as rapes and robberies. Trafficking people is more profitable than drugs or prostitution now. That's terrible. It's surprising to hear about a case like yours these days. 
hopefully you'll help me. Hmm. I need to hear more about the situation first. So, the photo of Hojo. This is Hojo. I actually don't have many pictures of him. I'm sure it'll come in useful. It looks like the type of guy Sad Sadaki would get along with. Right. Um, ask about a request one more time. I don't think that's going to change anything. So you want me to look for him? Please help my husband. Turns out Tokugawa is involved. That could complicate things. Hojo's behavior. We asked about that, right? You notice anything unusual about your husband before he disappeared? All the years I knew him, he'd been your typical company employee. He'd get up, leave for work, then come walking through the door at the end of the day. They schedule day in and day out. Quite a change from my hours. Past few months, he'd become more unpredictable, you might say. Can't really draw anything concrete from that. You think he'd become involved in something, though? My gut feeling, yeah. There were indications of some sort of trouble beforehand. The chances of being in a ransom kidnapping are pretty slim. Clues. Look at some clues. So you keep going through the story, just kind of keep asking her questions, and you get more answers to it. That helps solve crime. Lorraine, right, I'm going to need more than just your instincts at this time. Raiders, welcome. I have a few things Kenzo gave me. Some drug capsules and a piece of police. Hey, Camilio. I don't know what they mean. They may be of help. Capsules on a leaf. He said to me, if anything happens to me, give these to the police or someone you trust. Quite a statement. See? And then he just disappears. Hi, Raiders. Welcome, Camilio. How's Return to Zork going? Anywhere near the end? I remember it being a long game, but that's only because puzzles were very challenging for me at the time. Yeah, this is Police Knots. It's one of Hideo Kojima's original games. Hideo Kojima, of course, made Metal Gear Solid. In the Metal Gear games after that. He also made that Stranding. This is one of his early games. For those of you who um, may not know about it, it was only ever released in Japan. It got translated. Uh, PS1 version here. It was on the Saturn, the 3DO. Vita had a version. Um, PS3 had a version. PC98 was when it first came out. It's a classic game. It's well known. Never released here. A lot of anime, a lot of Japanese, a lot of me reading it. It's a detective story. According to points, 100 of 225. Oh, points. Okay. But I feel I'm closer to the end than the beginning. There you go. There you go. Yeah, I, I don't know if you need all 225 points to beat the game. That I don't remember, but you're getting there. Silent Hill? Never heard of it. <laughs> no. Never heard of Silent Hill either. There's a lot to this game. This was a viewer's choice game picked by our good friend DRS43. Let me give you a shout out, Camilio. For those of you who are wondering, Camilio was playing Return to Zork tonight. He finished System Shock 2 earlier. He's also been playing the GDMX, I think it's called GDMX version of Deus Ex. Check out his stream. Unrecognized Shadow Command. Damn you. Every now and then it just does not work. At least for me. Try it again. There we go. This time it worked. Cool. Finished game. Very short remake. Ah, you put in about two weeks of it, right? Possibly. Uh, capsules. Let's ask about the capsules on the lease. This is basically a detective story. You keep asking questions to find the clues, and 
She wants to hire us to find her ex-husband. Story, if you're interested. We were a police officer sent to outer space. Okay, we were trained to be police officers on a space colony that the Earth had orbiting around itself. You know, the countries created this orbiting space station that people could live on called the Beyond. Uh, as part of our training, we went outside for a spacewalk. Uh, our line snapped, so we got hurled into space. We were put into a capsule, like a protective capsule. We never aged. We were in cryogenic sleep. That was in 2013. Now it's 2038. They saved us from outer space, finally. Brought us back to Earth. It's three years after, so it's... 20... 2041, I guess? Something like that. And we're a detective back on Earth. We don't like going to space. This is our ex-wife. She's older than us, obviously, because we never aged. We remarried. And she wants us to help her find her, her husband. So, that's the story. Nine streams is not a short game, like 20 plus hours. Yeah, that's pretty long. It took us 10 streams to do, uh, well, nine and a half streams to do Crusader No Remorse, so. I guess we'll start with capsules. That then? The capsules. Here they are. What are they for? I have no idea. I wonder if they're made by Takagawa Pharmaceuticals. Will you hang on to them for me? Ask about the leaf he also found. And the leaf? That is there? There it is. I've never seen a leaf like this. Why is it cut in half like this? It was like that when I got it. Can I give it to you to hold on to? Uh, let's ask her again about her daughter. Curiosity. Be 27 soon. She's still single. Hard to believe you have a 26 year old daughter. I'm 55 now, remember? Got married real young, didn't they? A photo of her husband. It was taken a while back. He's gained some weight since then. You could try correcting it with CG if you had the chance. Yeah, you mean? Alright, uh, what else do we take a look at? I doubt, no doubt about it, it's really her. He's shocked that his ex-wife showed up. Hey, Lorraine? Why don't we continue? He doesn't want to hear us talk. Is there anything else? There was one thing he kept mentioning. It was the word Plato. Plato? Plato? Plato or... Yeah, Plato. Not Plato. You got me. Plato. Plato. Could you have said Pluto? To be honest, I'm not sure anymore. We still haven't been to Pluto, though. Well, thanks for bringing me up to speed. There's certainly more to this than meets the eye. So he'll help me, right? Jonathan? I'll pay you whatever you want. Dollars or yen? Just let me know. Hold on, Lorraine. Can't decline the case, except the case. If we decline the case, there's no reason to play the game. Right? Lorraine. I can't give you an answer today, Lorraine, but I will consider it. Jonathan, don't tell me you're not going to help. I didn't say that, I just need some time to think. Still in shock. Sure. That's right. Thanks. I'll hang on to these in the meantime. Well, I'll be in touch.
Staying at the Hotel New Rose in Donnelly Hills is a full weekend. Call me anytime. Pretty much an LA Blade Runner kind of setting. Again, I don't expect you to forgive me. More realistically, I don't wait for you. I didn't wait for you, I'm sorry. I was so happy when I heard you'd been rescued. If only they'd found you a little sooner, things would have been different. I just wanted to you to know that. Feels like a soap opera. Lorraine, how did you get here, by the way? We rented a car at the hotel. This old classic. I see. Well, it was nice seeing you again. Yeah. Bye. It's truly an anime. You got just awkward scenes where they just stare at each other. Early anime was like that. A lot of staring and weird facial expressions. Lorraine. Lorraine. I missed you too. Like you wouldn't believe. Wow, that looks like a Bentley or something. The <laughs> prince by the car. Oh, who's this guy? Lorraine, get away from the car! Uh-oh. No! Oh. oh my god. Oh my god, they killed her. Blew up her car. Oh, here's one of the shooting scenes. Where'd he go? How you fight in this game. Not sure how or what the controls are. He's got a gun. Yep, shooting. I don't know what his health is, but. Oh, okay. I have to reload the gun. I didn't realize that. Kind of like Virtual Cop, right? I know I'm hitting you. Uh -oh. It's a garbage truck. Oh, damn it. Or a street sweeper. I didn't really see what it was. Great. Now, where'd you disappear to? Standing behind there, so to speak. We got him. Or he just moved over. Oh, he ran away. Ran down the alley. I've got you now. Ran past the ravioli company. Look. It's an alleyway, but goes quite a back quite a bit. Face him. Through that alley. Okay, here we go. Where's he going? He's fast, all right. He just ran in here a second ago. So much for following his footprints. That snow obviously didn't stick. Shoes. Looks like it continues further back. Advance. 
Maybe I should have looked at the footprints first. Where is he? Find them. He was done with spray paint. In the bag? There's garbage bags. These garbage bags have been placed next to a dumpster. They're made out of biodegradable plastic. That is not snow. <laughs> of course not. The plastic has started to decompose. They must have been here a while. Got yeah, like blue blood, that's what it is. There's some kind of liquid on the ground. It looks like milk, no? I don't think it's milk. It's white blood. She's running artificial blood. Trail stops here. And he can't get be too far away. Okay, so he's around here somewhere. Look. There's a drum up ahead. The wall's got pipes going up and down it. Pipes. They have barbed wire on them. I doubt anyone could climb them. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm gonna have to drink a lot of water when playing this game. There's so much to read. There aren't any blood stains on them either. There's no way you could have climbed these. Okay. Not the vent. That's the building ventilation shaft. The grate doesn't look like it can be moved. A person could never fit through here. Save the game. Second save. Pretty cool so far. It, it's very cinematic. He goes back some more. Let's advance. I'm guessing he's around here somewhere. This is where the blood stops too. So he's here. He's got to be in the dumpster then. So it won't let us advance. It's a dumpster. There's just enough room for someone to hide behind it or maybe even in it. Looks cool. Very stylish. Yeah, and it's got this old Noyer detective kind of 80s music to it. Feels kind of lethal weapon-ish, Blade Runner-ish. It could easily be inside there. Looks like it's full of garbage. There don't seem to be any blood stains on it. Uh, what about here? Did it go in here? Because that's where the blood ends. He certainly could be in there. There's something about it, actually. It better be careful around there. Can't wait for the Kojima twist. I thought the twist was when Lorraine's car blew up, no? There's probably more to it. You better be careful around there. It matches up exactly with where the blood stops. Alright, what about this door? The other doorway is a possibility too. I think he's around. All right, so it's not letting me advance. He's here. Can't really see too far down the hallway. He admits he can't. Son of a bitch! I can't see a thing. Blood stops here. He must be around here somewhere. All right, you're gonna keep saying that. He's got to be in the dumpster. I have to get closer to check it out. Let we get closer. We got to advance. The music's pretty cool, right? Very... Very 2 o'clock in the morning... 48 hours kind of, kind of music, if you've ever watched that movie. I'm guessing he's around here somewhere. Alright, you won't let me advance, but you're telling me to get closer to this thing. How do we do that? I have to get closer to check it out. So... Could very well be. I like this song. I like the soundtrack. 
We'll use this for something, maybe. This. This looks like one of the building's air conditioning ducts. What's this thing? It's. Can it possibly be inside one of these? Could easily be inside there. Have to get closer to check it out, but he won't advance. More pipes. Pipes are all the same. They've got bob wire on them and you couldn't climb these. Alright, we know that. How do we get closer? How do we advance? Alright, I get it. But... Those are wooden boxes filled with empty bottles. They'd be perfect size for someone to hide behind. Ooh. Okay, I think we found them. Music changed. Ah, oh, we're shooting again. The rat. Uh oh. There he is. Targeting him is really tough. Mainly because I'm using the analog stick. can kill you. I don't see a health meter for him, though. Sure he gets hit ten times, and then we advance. There we go. Got him. Alright, he's running. Came out on PC98 first, that explains the mouse pointer. Yep. This guy even human? Oh, well, with white blood, he may not be human. <clears throat> Microsoft had a Japanese version of Windows and DOS for PC98 and PC98 exclusive to Japan. I didn't know that. So this is 94. It would have been before Windows. Definitely DOS, though. I'm not going to let you get away. Killed my wife. My ex-wife. Come on. Nobody's not Whatever. It's a dead end anyway. There's something else on the ground. As I kill you. Or Win 3.1. Oh yeah, it could have been Win 3.1. You're still playing it on DOS though, either way. Probably had Win 3.1. It's writing. It's different from the graffiti on the dumpsters. I'll kill you. Bastard. Is this some kind of game to you? There are more wooden boxes here. These are empty, though. Doesn't look like he's here. He left a message for me. He should still be around here, though. Can't see very well, but I'm pretty sure this is a dead end up ahead. Advance. The dead end up there. There's no need to hurry. I should check this area out a little more. Keep looking, I guess. It's a concrete wall. I don't see anyone anywhere he could hide. I don't think he'd hide in the same place twice. Where is this guy? There's nothing here really to hide in. 
More boxes here too. There isn't enough room to hide behind these boxes. This. I don't think you can climb this. Even if you use the boxes as a foothold, he still wouldn't get anywhere. Didn't Japan have OS2? Like, wasn't that kind of popular in Japan too? Or maybe I'm thinking of Europe. This wall is going to go way back. There's nowhere he could hide. There's nowhere to hide anywhere. Let's advance. He comes running down here, I'll have a perfect shot at him. Dude, I don't think he's running down here. In the vents. We look, took a look at the vents. DRS, how are you? I was tr gonna try to contact you to let you know that we started this tonight. We didn't get too far in. Lorraine's car blew up, and now we're after the culprit. So, maybe Macintosh? I don't think Mac was ever popular in Japan, but I could be wrong. OS2 was a big push in Europe because of the Olympics and how they sponsored it. I've been lurking. Oh, good. So you got to see it. Excellent, DRS. Finished Crusader No Remorse earlier. That was kind of a weird ending. We never had to kill the boss. So. Japan PC market was dominated by NEC Sharp MSX computers. I actually had an NEC 386 computer back in the day. That was my computer throughout high school. It was a really good computer. Um, ran Windows 3.1, which is cool. And I really liked the design of it. It had like this glass plate on the front with the numbers behind it. And I think it only had two megs of RAM, I believe. I don't remember much of it. I got the... I have the um, manual for it somewhere. I'm really proud of that computer. I think I still have it somewhere. And then the only other NEC product I ever had was a multi-sync monitor, which was considered like one of the greatest monitors of all time back in the day. Yes, welcome to DRS. That's no surprise, NEC computers and their path through the 80s. You had a good antique. Yeah, I need to see if I could find it. I kept that one. I had an Olivetti M28 computer from Italy. That was the first IBM clone ever made. Um, it wasn't the greatest computer, but I used to do all my reports in school on it. Grammar school, grade school. I don't think you could climb this. So there's vents here? Um, we already, wait, there's a window back here. I don't think you could climb this. Hiding here again? You're gonna kill me, huh? So what's taking you so long? Show yourself, asshole. Oh, all right, that's advancing in story. When is Kojima gonna work? Be cool to get a VGA capture adapter and stream games from it. Yeah. Big action sequence. Ninja's getting away on the bike. Assassin. That is not really Ninja. Here come the cops. They're going to the uh, scene of the crime. Fuck. Cool little action sequence. Do you want to save? Yes. Do an alternate saves. Overwrite it. And we're also going to do a save state. Yes. Kira! I, I think I have the manual here. I gotta see it in a box or something. I, want, I can't remember what graphics 386 had. I think it had 16 color VGA. I didn't really use it for games though. I did mostly school work on it. I might have played like Darklands on it, maybe. 
It stopped snowing. One last chance to look at the stars together. I missed you so much. Lorraine. That watch. I still wear it. Of course. You know I am with the time. You kept it all this time. Jonathan, please. Karen's sick. You have to help her. Karen's your daughter. She, she needs a rain. You know her? He was an old friend. Poor thing. She came from beyond, huh? Yeah. No. Came back. So wait a second. And rather, she came back to me. So rather than taking her to the hospital, he just sat there with her for a while until she passed away. Probably could have saved her. Uh, this is the PS1 version. So I'm playing it on an Xbox controller because I had it hooked up for Crusader No Remorse. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for choosing American Space Flying Flight 797 to the On Coast. We have completed our gravity turn and are proceeding as scheduled to the colony. As we are now entering zero gravity, should you begin to feel sick, press the call button located by your window, and one of the flight attendants will be of help. Yeah, we're we're emulating this. Um, so, oh, this guy. Okay, looks interesting. You okay? You don't look too good. I'm not a big fan of space. You have SAS. Interesting. Is this your first time? No, I had an accident out here a long time ago. I've had cosmophobia ever since. I already hear that. You should ask one of the stewardesses from, for the medicine. The call button is a red switch on the wall. I'm good for now. Thanks. Got a tattoo on his forehead? Conversation is the best way to take your mind off something. We should take advantage of the opportunity. Tony Redwood. Tony Redwood, nice to meet you. I like how they have the original names for Japan. Jonathan Ingram, same here. Alright, I guess we talked to him. Yeah, so PS1, emulated of course, even though I probably could play it on the uh, on the PS2, because it does play PS1 discs. And Xbox controller for now, I probably next stream switch to a PS1 controller. To be fair, most 3x386s did not have a good GPU, but plenty of games work on the 386. There's a fast thumb release that runs almost on a 386. I used to play, the games I was playing at the time were Earl Weaver Baseball. It was an 80s baseball game. It was a fantastic game. Um, Ancient Art of War at Sea. I don't know if you ever heard of that game. That was a big 80s game. It's basically what Black Flag was for Assassin's Creed. You just pull up, you, you're basically a sea captain, pirate. You pull up your ship, next to other ships and then you just like you know fly over and try to take over their ships and destroy them it, it was such a cool game back in the day those are the main games i was probably playing at that time maybe dark lands although dark lands might have been when i got the ps the p5 the pentium 5 but pretty sure it was with the 386 all right let's talk to this guy he's an unusual kind of guy he looks awkward to talk to Ask him about his tie. I like his tie. What is it? Something bothering you? Not gonna talk to us too much. Face. Remarkable, isn't it? An emotionless vacuum, silencing all but the tiniest of organisms. Sid Mears Pirates is my favorite game. <laughs> nice. Are you seeing the emotes? Because I have. I'm watching Twitch through my phone, and 
not seeing them. If I exit. We're going to add more better. Better stuff. Should have done that earlier. I just never really set it up. Blame Twitch. I always blame Twitch. You know that. Their fault. Uh, yeah, maybe you can't use it. That's right. That's right. They never update their apps. And if they do, it's stupid reasons. Those third-party tools can probably see emotes. Yeah, that's probably right. You don't see it as an option? It takes a while for it to show up, apparently. Maybe I never turned them on correctly. All the other remotes are showing. I'll figure it out off stream. Moving your head a lot will only make your SAS worse. What is SAS? What does SAS stand for? What's that crest on your jacket? That? This? It's the police knots crest. Police knots. From back in the day. Why is he sweating? He's sweating because he's in outer space and he doesn't want to be out of space. He has cosmophobia. What sort of badge is that? Oh, just this thing I have. Kind of a good luck charm. It's this tattoo. Sorry if I'm being rude, but what's that writing on your forehead? This is my tag. All Frozeners have it. Frozener. Trigonometry, side angles. What do I mean? Side angle, side, and trigonometry. It's never good at math. I see your injured arm. I just burned it a little. There's a way to turn better um, emotes on in yes, I think. I don't know how you do that or why you would do that. I'll look into that. Must be painful. The best environment for treating a burn is zero gravity. Button do. There's a button to call the stewardess and a button for the TV here. Press the call button. Let's call the stewardess. Call the stewardess over. Hello. Hi. How did you get here? How can I help you? Ooh, not feeling too well, are we? Might be SAS. Oh, sure it is. The best thing you can do is try to relax. Thanks. Is there anything I can do for you? Uh, this is where Kojima starts getting weird with the fan service, I think. You have exquisite legs. Thank you. But in zero gravity, the legs appear thinner than normal because your blood lights in the upper half of your body. All bird-like. Really? Twitch mobile, I oh, okay, that's why. But the extensions for a browser can see them, or third-party tools like Chatty, Chatterino, OBS Chat on screen. Ah, okay. Oh, hold on. I got OBS. May not be able to do this because it's streaming. I know there's an option for this. An advance? I think it's an advance. Browser acceleration.
I know there was a way to do this. It's probably because I'm online. I can't. It was an option at one point. They moved it elsewhere. Yeah, I don't see it. Sorry, we're gonna explore more of the fur in a second, but I just wanna... Where's this option? Was it in the stream area? No problem, Braxton. Have a good night. I'll catch you on your stream tomorrow as well. Thanks for hanging out, man. And thank you for uh, staying around for the other Crusader No Remorse. I appreciate it. Have a good one. And thank you again for sharing that Natalie Portman rap. That, that was awesome. It was unexpected for Natalie Portman. All right, I think I gotta be off stream to do this. Just cancel. This is where the game starts getting awkward. That's a really tight skirt. This is a special skirt designed to prevent SAS. It puts pressure on the abdomen to prevent excessive blood from moving to the upper half of the body as much as possible. Our entire uniform is designed this way. About her bow. Your uniform is a nice color. It really brings out your curves, too. Did you really have a conversation like this with a stewardess? It works just like my skirt. You may not know that we wear a rubber undershirt, too. It helps resent the muscles from atrophying in zero gravity. So why are they wearing all this stuff for zero gravity, but we don't have any protection like that? Shouldn't we all be wearing spacesuits? All right, let's ask the obvious question. Oh, are you not wearing a bra? They look so perky. Come on, Kojima. Seriously? That's right, you don't need a bra in zero gravity. Nor do you need to worry about your hips, breasts, or cheeks sagging. God for zero gravity. Dare I do this? You know, I don't think I've ever felt the pair in Zero Garrity before. <laughs> what are you doing? Sexual harassment, Jonathan. This would really, really help my SAS. <laughs> Alright, enough of this. This is getting weird. What are you doing? What is Zero Gravity for? <laughs> That'd be kind of interesting, wouldn't it? You're really cute. Your face is a little chubby, though. In zero gravity, your blood collects in the upper half of your body. Which is why you have a chubby face. Causing your face to swell a little. Oh, moon face. <laughs> this is an exact translation, isn't it? Let's talk to her. Um, miss? Yes? Ask about the Beyond. Beyond Coast, mankind's first space colony was completed in 2010. Since immigration was opened to the general public in 2013, the colony's population has grown to approximately 1 million people. City in the sky. Nearly one third of the current population is comprised of second generation inhabitants. Uh, let's ask about SAS. The medical definition of space adaption syndrome, or SAS, now we know what it means, is the symptoms one experiences during adaption to zero gravity. It varies from person to person. <laughs> Jeez. 
Let me drink some water. Hold on. I don't even think I have water. Hold on. I'm gonna bring a water bottle for the next stream. It varies from person to person, but over 50% of people develop symptoms within one to two hours of entering weightlessness. Uh, the plane, of course. Normally, we would spend the eight the night in an eight Earth orbiting space station and then travel the rest of the way in an orbital transfer vehicle. This is the direct flight to beyond, which takes about two hours. According to Kerbal Space Program, SAS could be Stability Augmentation System. Stability uh, Assist System, Sickness Avoidance Scheme, and Sickness Avoidance Solution. There might also be like a loss of translation here. Arrival time. How much longer will it be until we arrive? We've just passed the halfway point. you now just past the halfway point there's no need to worry we'll get there in one piece i promise you think you can give me something for my sas this is around the time your sas will be at its worst but you'll feel better soon take the medicine here is a relax effects then relax effects who makes this Hekagawa pharmaceuticals oh connection Thanks. Here goes nothing. Fix it. Well, SAS are real and used in real um, aircraft. Okay. Yeah, Kerbal Space Program is pretty accurate, so if it's in that game. This is around the time your SAS will be getting worse. You'll feel better soon. Take medicine. Gonna OD on it. Still not feeling better? Here you are. Thanks. Let me try another. It's flirt. How does you and me having dinner under the stars after we land sound? I don't know if it's such a good idea. All he has to say. Um, why would we show her the photo of Hojo and Lorraine? There's no way she knows who they are. You ever seen this man in the photo before? I'm sorry, I don't know either of them. Rain? What do you think of this picture? This is a beautiful woman. This is a photo of me and Lorraine from when we went to Lucas World. The one I had sitting on my desk back in my office. Never hurts to think ahead. Capsules. You ever seen capsules like this before? You just took something for SAS, remember? Any idea what kind of fleet this is? Doesn't look familiar, no? Don't forget that if you're taking plants into beyond, you need to be inspected at the pace spaceport. Uh, the police knots photo. She's not gonna know what this is. She's probably too young to even know what the police knots were. Do you recognize this photo? Yes, I've seen it in textbooks. They were Beyond's original cops. I think that's it for her. Size. Size of what? Colony is a cylinder type. It's 6.5 kilometers in diameter and 32 kilometers in length. It makes one complete rotation every two minutes, creating artificial gravity virtually equal to that of Earth's 1G. Colony's surfaces and mirrors are divided into three sections around the central axis, with each section having an area of 90 square kilometers. It's the first and last O'Neill type colony. Under beyond, blah blah blah. Can I assist you with anything else? So, excuse me? Yes.
We can ask her about the toilets, the meals, the passengers, the body of the plane. Let's ask her for the toilets. In accordance with stricter space debris regulations, the plane doesn't eject waste out into space. Like before. But you won't get the chance to see any space fireflies, like Project Mercury's astronauts. Glenn or Milky Ways, like the Aurora 7's astronaut carpenter. What does that mean? Meals? Space food has vastly improved over the years, and it's actually quite tasty now. Following the latest trends on Earth, we offer Japanese cuisine as well. However, because flavors aren't preserved very well under low air pressure, we don't bother using any exotic flavorings in our food. Still have a long way to go yet. Just try to relax and enjoy the play. That's it for talking to her. SAS and Police Knots version uh, of OS SOS. Banging messages in a bottle by the police. There you go. Symptoms of SAS. Symptoms include dizziness, cold, sweat, vomiting, headache, and fatigue, and are often accompanied by a false feeling of falling over that doesn't occur in normal motion sickness. As long as they last is about two days, however, you should be fine by the time we arrive. I think the first time I went to Europe, or the second time I went to Europe, I experienced this SAS. I had jet lag for like two days. Start to feel better soon, don't take the medicine. You're free, how about showing me around the beyond? Man, what should I do? Consider that if you work for Tokugawa. Alright, I think we're done. Is there anything else I can do for you? Thanks for your time. You're welcome. Call me again if you need anything. You don't feel like talking about anything? You should talk to him. Mind if we talk? background. Your skin looks a little... It's always like this. Yes. Why is your skin that color? Because of my artificial blood. My red blood cells are actually white. Oh, he's like the guy we who killed Lorraine. Is he the killer? I hope not. White blood. I use first generation artificial blood, which is less complex than third generation kind you see at home. Are you from beyond? Yes, I was born and raised there. I had a family matter to attend to on home. And yourself? Are you a terrestrial? Not exactly. I used to be an amphibian. Is he a dolphin? Like a cool little character here. I thought he was like maybe a cyborg. You know, going back and forth between home and beyond? An amphibian? You were one of the amphibians? It was a long time ago, back when we were called astronauts. Okay. Do for a living. First generation artificial blood. Are you military? Something like that, yes. I am a frozener, after all. What about that injury to your arm? Yes, what about it? Ah, uh, never mind. Ask about frozeners. What do you mean by frozener? Frozener is someone created from an artificially fertilized egg held in cryogenic staged storage by the government or the breeders, some people call them. So, describing how he was created, an artificial life form, or he's not really an artificial life form, but as a life form, does that mean he has no belly button because there was never an umbilical cord? One way to find out, I guess. The egg is later transferred to a surrogate mother for gestation and delivery. Okay, so a surrogate mother. So he does have an umbilical cord. And a uh, belly button. Oh yeah. Heard a little about them. There's still a severe shortage of manpower in space development. You. You sound like I'm boring you. Uh, artificial blood. 
What does having artificial blood do for somebody? Artificial blood has a higher ox oxygen transportation efficiency than normal blood. It makes heavy blood loss less of a life-threatening condition. The body's functions are negatively affected in areas of low oxygen density either. Yeah, that's perfect for people working in space. Arrival time. When are we going to arrive? Didn't you just ask the stewardess? You know, I can understand why you're nervous. The odd isn't much further now. Those are all the questions. Uh, stop asking about arrival. Show him the Hojo photo. Maybe he knows him. I'm sorry, who are they? I don't know them. Yeah, I wouldn't expect you to. Is that your wife? Uh, no. Oh, so is she your girlfriend? Something about her reminds me of the woman from that other photo. I guess the ages are too far apart, though. Capsules. Those are the capsules the stewardess gave you. Those are for SAS. I don't need any. Actually, they're not. We're now learning that the capsules that she found, Lorraine found from her husband, are actually SAS capsules. What kind of leap is that? Much to say about it. Might not take much, make much sense to terrestrials, but Jan is home to me. Police Fnott's photo. Police Fnott's photo? Why am I not surprised? It's about as rare as that crest. It must have a real thing for them. Okay. I think we're done here. Maybe some sleep is what you need. Yeah, I think I finally settled it. I'll wake you if anything happens. Thank you. Notice he's got no sweat on his forehead now because he took the medicine. Ladies and gentlemen, we will shortly be arriving at Beyond Coast Spaceport. In the arrival area, you will each be required to undergo a space medical exam before going to immigration and customs. We will now be distributing beverages and salt tablets to help replenish body fluids lost during the flight. Thank you once again from all of us here for choosing American Space Line. We look forward to serving you again in the future flight, having crew prepare for docking. Cool. Smoking in videos. Yeah. Kojima. Firing at altitude thrusters. Moving into beyond orbit. He had a whole bunch of cigar cigarette butts in his uh, on his desk. When the game started. Rendezvous and docking laser now engaged. My question is, are we further away from Earth than the moon? We have to be, right? Yeah, of course we're going to save this. Still the prologue? No, this can't be the prologue, right? It's like chapter one, act one beyond. Okay, so we made it past the prologue. I like this story so far. I want to see where it goes. The whole thing with Lorraine was just like, oh my God, she blew up. I haven't seen her in like 30 years almost, but you know, she could care less about me. She just wants me to find her husband. Beyond coast. Beyond coast. Where the heavens meet the earth. Not a bit less mysterious than before. The negotiator privileges probably don't apply. 
Not sure I want to look for Hojo by myself anyway. I should see if I can get Head's help. I bet he'll be happy to do it. Head's on here. Head should be at the main station. He'll be in his mid-50s too. He's been there all the years, so he must be going and doing pretty well by himself now. I brought along my police knots photo and one of the rain for the heck of it. It might come in handy for something. BCP should be that far from here. Well, first things first, it's time to see it. So, this is really cool. I knew the game had animation, um, scenes and everything, but I didn't realize that the whole game is pretty much animated. Like, I thought it was just maybe pixels switching it out, but this looks like a looped video scene, and I think that's pretty cool for a game of this age. Save state it. So we get to explore this area, and we're gonna do that on the next stream. Getting a little late now, we'll turn in. This game is cool. I like it, I like the anime. Big fan of anime, especially older anime. Japanese is a nice touch. DRS, thank you for picking this one as well. Uh, finally finished Crusader No Remorse tonight, which was fun. This is gonna be good. This will take us a couple of streams. And uh, I'm sure we'll, we'll enjoy the entire story. There's a lot to be, to be seen here. It is Kojima. There's plenty of plan fan service as well. It'll be fun. So, my next stream is going to be Saturday at 11 a.m. Because of Father's Day this weekend, I won't be able to stream on, on Sunday. So, we're going to do Saturday at 11 a.m. Uh, no stream tomorrow night, obviously. We're trying to stick this schedule when we can. Next couple of weeks, I think we'll be streaming on Wednesdays instead of Tuesday. If I do not see you this weekend, please have a wonderful Father's Day if you're celebrating it. Happy Father's Day to your dads. Pixel Graves, thank you for hanging out and thank you for the raid. You're welcome. Emilio, also thank you for the raid if you're still here. Um, yeah. It's, it's going to be a fun ride with this game. And I'm curious about Snatcher, too, so I'll talk to you about that. Pixel we'll, Graze will figure out how, how to uh, maybe play that in the future. I know a lot of people play it, but at least once we should. He was online. Playing. Be playing. Rock Evolution GBA. All right, guys. Thanks for hanging out. I'm sorry I've been kind of out of it the last couple of days. It's been a tough time at work, but usually, as for most people, it's something I need to handle. Talked about it in the Discord, obviously. It's I'll get through it. Just annoying. But that's why we stream, to get our mind off things. Have a great weekend if I don't see you guys, and we'll talk soon. Hey, okay. join the raid. The wrong person I'm raiding. Camilo's not even on. Why am I raiding Camilo? Creature 92. Say hello. Seeing the emotes, I'll figure that out too. Hi, right, guys. <laughs>